Hey guys, what's up? Today we're going to be making a new type of video. We're going to be doing a rant video. I've never done one of these. And this one's going to be about Apple products. So, with Apple products, you have all these different things that look really good, and then they just don't seem all that worth it to me because most of them are made out of aluminum and... Aluminum is a cheap material to make. Uh, it's just really cheap. So with Apple products, they're like really expensive. Like one of the newest iPhones is at least, or the least for it is $1,100 for the iPhone XS Max. And it's just not okay. The prices are just skyrocketed way too high. I have a phone that's basically doing the same thing for $500. I have the OnePlus 5T, which is way better than whatever Apple thinks they're doing good. And I don't feel like you need tons of cameras, and the notch doesn't make too much sense to me, but some people like that about the phones. Um, they have all these different features and now no home button the home button was their thing only the home button in the middle that was their thing and then they just got rid of it which kind of just defeated the purpose and they added the screen recording feature which is cool but for the price the phone is so cheap to make and it just doesn't make sense to me you can have a phone that's just as good for the price of my phone, which is $500. And it's just really outrageous for the prices. I don't understand that. Also, with the iPhones, they have, like, okay, we're going to make a phone, sell it for $700, and it's not going to be that good. It's basically just a random version of the iPhone 6 or 7. I don't even know if it's as good as the iPhone 7, but I feel like they just didn't make it how they should have. They could have made it so much better for probably the same price, but instead they decided, let's work on the stupid stuff and raise the price about $200 more than it should be. So, it's just really stupid with phones from Apple basically I I used to have an iPad from Apple iPad Air and it was I mean it worked but for like $400 I don't think I would pay $400 if I knew how much that was cuz I got it for Christmas one year and I don't feel like I would actually get that if I knew what it was so the prices for Apple products are just really skyrocketed up more than they should be you can have basically a phone for about well the maxed out iPhone XS Max is around 1450 so $1450 that's like just way too much it's three it's almost three times the amount of my phone and my phone works probably just as good yeah the screen might be smaller it might be a little bit smaller but it's way more worth it I don't understand Apple products it just it bugs me how many people buy these because they think that it's a good deal like it's kinda like IKEA you're gonna be paying two hundred dollars for this table and then the table is made out of cheap wood that's that's my problem with stuff like that if you're gonna charge one thousand dollars for a phone at least make it worth it dude it's just I don't understand the reasoning for stuff like that it's just really obnoxious for them to raise the price that high and I just don't understand it. It's really confusing. 
I I have had experience with the Apple devices and they're just they're not worth the one thousand dollars especially. Like I used to have an iPod touch that that broke by me accidentally putting my knee on it. Um it the, the screen just cracked, iPod touch five, and it just cracked so easily. So I brought it to school one year in fifth grade. I'm in eighth. I brought it in fifth grade and I went to get my stuff and put it together. And the iPod just cracked right as I put my knee on it. I felt it crack below my knee too. So they could at least make the screens maybe a little bit stronger for sure. Um, I just feel like the prices are just too high. That's my main point with this. So, I think the prices are too high. The product is not as good as it could be for sure. Especially for that price point. And, yeah. I just think that I don't, it just doesn't make sense to me. They could do so much more with a $1,000 phone. And everybody would have no reason to complain. You can probably make iPhone XS Max for about seven six to seven hundred dollars so yeah that's it for this video and like the video if you want to see more rants i'll see you guys later peace